So as some of you know, I attended the uh, Kennedy School of Government at Harvard. I got a master's degree in public administration. So there's a professor there named Danny Roderick, he was not there when I was attending, who now says that if you even work for the Trump administration in any capacity, that you are not entitled to respect. Here's the quote. Trump's close associates and political appointees are his enablers. Regardless of their personal merits and how much they try to disassociate themselves with Trump's utterances, qualities like intelligence, effectiveness, integrity, and collegiality have little to commend them when they are deployed to advance an illiberal political agenda. Unquote. Okay, so he's basically saying that Harvard and every other university should banish, ban, uh, attack anyone who works or is associated with Donald Trump. This is fascism. So what they did in Italy in the 30s, in Spain in the 30s, Germany in the 30s, the Soviet Union in the 20s and 30s. Fascism. You demonize your opponents. It's his opinion, this dopey professor. I mean, I could just... I just wish I was back there for a day and I was sitting in his class, I could destroy him. So it's your opinion, Professor, that the Trump administration is immoral or racist or whatever you want to say. It's your opinion. Now you're seeking to impose your opinion on institutions like Harvard University so they can punish people that you don't like. It's fascism. That's what fascists do.